We can define my black Cinderella, and we can find Wagwan, 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 Wagwan. Wanna deal it? Wanna deal it? Oh, we say happy Kwanzaa, happy Kwanzaa, happy Kwanzaa. No bun dirty Christmas. Happy Kwanzaa. Tonight, tonight in a girl is Wednesday. One lucky lady are going to win 300 US dollar. She not have to do nothing. She not have to skin out, not have to go up on her head, not have to do nothing. We're going to just pick a female out of the club. We look nice and just get her 300 dollar. It nah share it nah not one smuddy. One smuddy. Zine? One smuddy I win the three bills. One smuddy. If she wanna give smuddy something out of her winnings. So it got tonight, Gallis Wednesday, at the spot by university. Right beside Pepper Seed Restaurant. That's so exactly beside Pepper Seed Restaurant. Yeah. That's how we are giving three bills a little more. Mm -hmm. Live with her. Library. Yeah, I'm going to fix things ah, for work. Yeah, yeah, man, I'm fine. See? So one lucky lady, I'm going to win $300. You know, right through the year, we do a thing, and God make we survive, and we eat food, so we give back. It's my way of giving back. So tonight, $300 to one lucky lady, I win 300 US. Can help pay a bill, can help do something, can buy a gift, can... You understand? Yeah, tonight, tonight, Gallis Wednesday. The last Wednesday in 2021 before we move over into 2022. And it's also the Kwanzaa season. Zine is, 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 is the harvesting season. It's the harvesting season, you understand what I mean? Say? So, we are give back to the harvesting. And, you understand me? Yeah, so 300 US dollar to one lucky female tonight just come out and look good and enjoy yourself and you get money simple Gandhi big up yourself you know you know the thing go big up DJ Gandhi of the worst team in the NBA but everything good alright people you know why I really come live now to beg the government of Jamaica and the JCF members, the Jamaica Constabulary Force, not to kill Joshi. You hear me say a while ago? White all in high place, big up. I am here today pleading and begging for the life of the little artist named Joshi. We have to face reality and we have to face the truth. Nothing that the kids said was a lie. Zine? Now, we know the truth can be harsh. We know the truth can be painful. We know the truth can be hard to digest. But me don't want to use ignorance and arrogance now and kill the youth. Can I see what's going on you now? Remember, at one stage in my career, and my other career, the government and the system tried to do with the same thing. Remember two and a half short term memory people. Remember one at a time when you see in the paper it say Futa I and Movado mark for death. See? So Joshi probably not understand this. I close them I close in by any youth. Joshi. Let me turn the camera so you don't see me properly. Joshi. A close them a close in for you if you kill you. Either them are gonna kill you or them are gonna try give a case. Please.
Joshi, you now have to move extra careful. Extra, extra careful. Don't get me wrong, people. I am not against the Jamaica Constabulary Force for doing them job. But me know how Jamaica police work. When them ignorant and upset with your problem. Remember one time them want to lick where keep rich wicked, wicked, wicked. Over one song where keep, keep rich it sing. When they are fully loaded and keep rich have to hide in one jerk pan. Come out of the venue to hold them want to hold him. Again, we go out of St. Thomas again. When them want Klu Klux Bunty Killer. Remember my car killer did in half a half a then exit. Me and baby G they drive. Killer fired in the back of the car. And then exit going in a different vehicle and when him go up in the mountain, then they go go up, they go catch him. So whenever you are a voice, a open voice of the truth, you are going to get backlash and really cool and and, and them are gonna try. If you do your things because Jamaica is a different place. So, Joshi, don't get me wrong, you know. Not what you're saying at the interview, you no know, wrong because you are being brutally honest. But you see, right now, them are for you. First thing, them lock you up one night, say you perform outside a COVID protocol. They know them slap where your producer will par with you. Say, me have gone. I don't know if it's true or a lie, I don't know. But I can see where this is going to lead to. Joshi, here how much you know? Because sometimes, we as the elder, them have to show me things because we experienced it already. What you say, and what you point out in the interview, you and the police are not safe. Every police in Jamaica, a prayer. See? Now, your police tend to get you now. You a garrison youth, you have to go around your artist. You might have a one youth that come around there with a stripper, feel like they want to protect the artist. That not going to work here. That not going to work. Here what you need to do. You need to call Mr. Mac, Mac Squad or one of them security company there. Charlie Chaplin or one of them security company there. And you have to go hire armed security guard to protect you. Uh, meaning, say, them at work. You see, like how you see, Andrew Will needs to have armed security around him at all times. Tough than the whole of them. It no matter that you can do it too. And your arm security them have to say anything will come to arm you them have to kill whether it be law man or regular man. Them job have to protect you. Zin? So a thing where we need have to do to survive. Me always have arm security around me. I can see them look like some thugs and just in a regular jeans and thing, I arm security them where I get paid. Every night I see foot I got a road. Yes, me have my thugs them who will fight for me and them think them I make sure me stay within the means of the law. The man them we have the gun them around me. I hired security when me pay me money. Every night I got a road me have to pay them. Every night. Every single night. I mean, I like have one of them alone around me. I like have two of them around me or more with firearm, no joke thing. You understand what I say? Josh, you see if you start move the right way right now, they might trick you and kill you. Josh, you understand a chance. If you are drive and you get a ticket, you can't beg no police no blind. See? If them only with a spliff, you can't beg no blind, they might charge you. If you are drink, what do you, you do video and you drink champagne and a drive stop them something if you are going to drink do not drive you and police not a lock 
me I tell you the whole police force hate you right now, brother. So you have to move different from the regular people. Then. You have to know that you're an enemy of the state right now just because you talk the truth. So you yeah, walk probably one day in a foot of hype foot. One day you now you yeah, just get a taste, a little, a little feeling. I would feel like to be foot of hype in a Jamaica. See? So you have to be extra cautious than the regular man. So, I see you do money pull up on night, you do about 50 grand one time. Here we have to start you now. You have to start calculating your security detail. Because this is if you want to live in you know? Or if you want to live free you know? Or if you want to stay a road you know? Because anyway you got a road, we just say thugs them alone. You're not going to dead and you're going to get disrespect and violated. And nothing can come out of it. You see, when you have license protection, meaning your higher security, anything up to your security, they have to give statement. They have to do as your witness. They have to make sure they bust them gun for protect your car that they might get paid for do. So when a police pull up on your entourage or pull over your car and you know, say, lawman in the car or hired security where them and them do the same work. You have to make sure that them people in your presence at all times. <coughs> now follow the man with no ego thing. But oh, you're a bad man. I want to you don't need no security. You stand now. That's why I always tell them, you know, say when you're a regular citizen, it's different from when you're an artist or a public figure representing the culture. Your life change. Your life change. Now, you look at you from Grandspan, me come from Cassava Peace, Grandspan, I'm a place. You's like this, a son of the soil. You understand? You're like somebody where I look up to, to take care of, like I take care of my little brother, I take care of fully them, or, you know? Me now, me now, I'm come to you. I'm not there, Jamaica. So the best me can give you know, advice. Because you got some man around here talk about, oh, I'm to you, DJ. The police can't ramp with you. Yes, they can ramp with you. Yes, police can ramp with you. Police can do anything they want to do. <coughs> Especially in a Jamaica. Remember in a foreign, police walk with a thing named body cam. And them still this year. I end up losing them job or them transfer them when body cam show. Jamaica can they use body cam, brother? Jamaica police are using body cam, they will kick at uh, Joshi. Let me tell you something. Them police at Jamaica will beat you to frazzle in front of everybody where you are part with. If you don't have proper security around you and proper people where you can get them in that trouble, they will kick you till you last, your shadow. They will beat you to sickness by roadside. Somebody said, why well, you never advise him like this for him to the interview? There was not need to advise him like this. Because we never know them are going to take it to, to the levy where they might try to do him now. Come and see what happened. So not, not happened before the time. No, it's the right time. Joshi is still alive. And we see what happened now. We have experience with that kind of behavioral pattern here with the Jamaica Constabulary Force towards entertainers. This is where me always I say artists, them figure public figure license gun and them thing there. Can now oh just she gonna protect himself. Can't protect himself. And police know that. Jamaica Constabulary Force work at them know say just she not a license gun. I remember me always I say that and then you see just she come ask Anthony say, You have a license gun? You're not afraid. I see him thing I reach Joshi now because Joshi now the lights a gun. So police knows that them can just see you anywhere and box you down and kick you down and do anything you can't defend yourself. So now, me I say to you now, you have to put in the proper elements to protect yourself. Call Max Squad them 
hire two licensed security to license bodyguard for your own protection. The same security firm, you rent a bulletproof vest from them to protect yourself. No, no shame, no night, you know. Nobody follow nobody, you know. Boy, you're a gangster, you're empty, you're ghetto, you live, you know, do that, you know. Yes, when you're a star, you do it. When you're a star, you do it. You have something to live for. You have a future that depends on you. You have to stay alive. Fit. Reach your goal where you want to reach. Me, this I tell you, I put it like this. Me always do it. Me always have two security around me. Always. Always. No matter where you see me. No matter where you see me. Two legal gun always around me. I mean, I talk license gun and people just have license gun. No. Security detail. Always. Some of them reason illiterate. It no matter who they are big up Joshi and want clout. What Joshi did say in the interview was a real thing. Everything when he say a real thing. Everything when he say the truth. Nothing no wrong with him interview. It's that, that people not taking it lightly. The police them vexed because he put them out there like that. You understand what I'm saying? Nothing no wrong with him interview. Nothing when he say no wrong. Everything when he say in the interview is facts. So nobody now look no clout. The man did have to tell the youth say the right thing himself. But obviously now you see the result of what the truth does. And the same thing happened to me on a day to day basis. Even for verbally assault, when we talk the truth, people verbally assault, start up beating foot at this dirty foot, a ray, 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 blah, 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 blah. You understand what I'm saying? You understand what I'm saying? So, all me I do this for now. Me see the need to come live and 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 talk to the youth because me see what them are try to do him. Me see what them are try to do him. When you see them kill a youth, they know we're so close to him. You know, so them are target him sector and who him they run. You understand what I mean? So right now, him for just ease off a road.